Welcome Welcome to Dreader. Apparently, it's a dark and stormy night. How about a game? Dreader is a short mouse maze game with horror elements. It could be one of those games that are just like, you know, you use the mouse, as you can see. You use the mouse and go through a maze and then a jump scare happens. That's basically what it feels like the game could be, but it's like in this retro-styled game-in-a-game sort of thing. This game contains flashing lights and may be unsuitable for people with photosensitivity... photosensitive epilepsy. Maze would like permission to access your visual cortex and related synaptic... Huh. Hopefully that just doesn't mean that... something else entirely. Welcome to the maze. The greatest treasure awaits. What, not death? All right, well, let's see how spooky this game can get. Oh, man, it's classic speaker setup, man. I remember playing Diablo 2 with a setup like that. Also, shit, the, the mouse in the game itself is moving with my mouse. That's cool. Attention to detail. Look at this. That's sweet. I'm pretty good at these games. You just gotta, I just got to make double... Gotta make doubly sure that this game doesn't turn into a jump scare. Are you alone? Uh, yes. I'm not gonna lie, fuck you, I have to click twice. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna presume this is gonna be one of those <laughs> horror games that maybe only last five minutes. Unless there's multiple endings, and I'll want to answer the question before. A big fat... A big fat no. I will get the treasure at the bottom. There is nothing behind you. Thanks for letting me know. Uh, turn around. Not the sound. So there's multiple questions. There could be multiple endings. Oh. 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 No. I'm descending. No distracting me. Distractions are illegal. My conquest. Oh. Thank you. My conquest is to go down the stairs endlessly. I'm, I'm thankful I don't have a squeaky door like that in real life. Oh. No, I'm not gonna turn. Descend! It's just like that, uh, psychologist game I played not long ago that was a visual novel. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, is it... It, tur oh, it turned into a boat, I get it, or a ferry. Interesting. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. See us, one. Treasure? Dumbbells? Wait, what? What is that? What's that supposed to be in the middle? Oh, window. Okay, let's 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 not focus too much on this. Let's proceed quickly. We don't want to stare at that. Possibly. Uh, there's nothing behind us. No. Nah. Oh shit. No. Okay, I think we have to go. No. No. It's just stop. We have to beat this. Oh no. No, you're. Why? Oh, okay, I'm fucked. Yep, yeah, um. Don't distract me, I'm playing Minecraft! I just. I just no. No, oh my god, I, well, I'm fucked. Oh, there's nothing behind me. Okay. I, I would have preferred beating that level myself, though. Thank you. God damn it. If there's literally nothing behind me, then... 
Hmm. I am not. I'm still not turning around. Uh oh. Maybe it's because I fucked up and I didn't beat that level, and I should go slower. I wonder if anything would change if I... Fuck. I wonder if anything would change if I actually beat that level. Ugh. Okay, I can't play this with the gamer sock. I need to dry my hands. Ugh. My gamer palm is gamer sweating. Ugh. Alright. Ugh. Oh my god. See, now without the sock... The cave-in. Seriously, okay. I see the gimmick of this stupid level. Alright. Alright. Huh. <laughs> like, what would happen if I didn't escape? Oh shit, oh, oh. Fuck you. Where's my treasure? Ah oh, shit. Eh. Kill half. I still want to know if there's multiple endings, though. I'm gonna have to replay as shit. <laughs> like, what happens if I turned around all the other times? Or what if I beat that area without failing that one level too many times? The end processing. Hmm. Is that it? Is that to. I'm gonna presume I'm gonna have to restart them. Hmm. That was interesting. But message received. Alright, let's try that again, but I will turn around whenever possible and also beat that one part of the maze. This greatest treasure, my ass. I wanted treasure, I wanted shinies. I'll be able to beat this super quick because the gamer sock is turned off. You might think that the gamer sock is meant to make you better at games, but honestly, only if it's casual game. Whoops. Alright, so it says there's nothing behind me. We're gonna turn around to see if anything happens. Let's turn around again. Hmm. Oops. Alright. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. Yeah, it's, it's extremely fucking hard, man. Come on, one more chance. I'm rushing, though. Oh my god! Seriously, it's it's doable, but fuck. I wanna like restart and get it, but I also don't wanna obsessively do the exact same thing repeatedly. Oh, it just it bugs me. It's so sensitive and your your guy's head is wobbling all the time. Oh, it bugs me. Yeah, I don't know. Um, how do you get past the level with the three moving boxes? 
the three moving boxes. Hmm. I'm gonna make the game full screen and try it one more time. Oh, because I'm not playing in windowed mode. If I, I'm playing like in a, a squished screen, so I will fix it and make it so I have a much bigger screen, full screen, and it should be easier to do that maze technically. I want to see if anything happens if you beat it, like any kind of secret, because it's hard, and I'm sure most people who are playing it for a first time will fuck up that level, and I want to know if there's anything for actually beating it. No, you're kidding me. What? Yeah, fucking hell, man. Oh, even in full screen, it's just I got so close. Actually, I wonder if I could. I wonder if I could glitch that like that. Hang on. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Oh, look at that. Hmm. <laughs> There's nothing here because I've been cheating the entire time. There's no screen because he never entered my room. I never unlocked my door. That's funny. <laughs> oh, shit. It did it anyways. I'll try to do it legit, then all the rest will be me fucking trying to cheat it. It's hard because it feels like the in-game mouse is like a bald mouse. Oh, you're kidding me. Yeah, they, it, it's an impossible game. Fuck me. I finally got there. Even if I were able to cheat this specific level, you'd never be able to go there and back. And if you could, I think... I think whoever's able to do that should get an easter egg or a special reward, because that would be difficult, like going there and back. I think you'd have enough time, but you'd have to have zero mistakes. Haha. <laughs> yeah, you can't do it in this one. Alright, next and last thing. We're gonna see what happens if the red thing... like. Yeah, what happens? Just... I guess we just fail and... Eh, whatever. It's uh, nothing bad or horrible happens. Like, no death happens, apparently. Hmm. Anyways, we'll leave it here. Interesting short horror game. Uh, if more variables and multiple endings, it would have been cool, but uh, likely not at this rate. So, I hope you enjoyed this interesting, uh, I'm not sure what to call it besides a horror game, I guess. I don't know, I hope you enjoyed. It was very interesting, um, uh, very entertaining, um, at least not obnoxiously loud jump scares like the, that one infamous, uh, mouse, mouse maze game that basically got everyone in the early 2000s or 90s. I can't remember when it came about. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a buff subscriber, hit the notification down below for updates of my videos. Thank you for watching, and until the next time.